Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another episode of the Venom Vlog, and I just wanted to give a quick first impressions of Venom Let There Be Carnage. I just got out of the theater and I actually had to stop at Target on the way home, and I was like, oh, I should do this where I have a little bit more, you know, light coming from outside and stuff, and then one in here to have as a backup. So, uh, so yeah, the movie overall, I gotta say, without spoiling anything, and I don't want any spoilers in the comments because I want to try to keep this episode spoiler free, but I will have episodes, you know, over the next few weeks that will be marked spoilers, and we can talk about spoilers in there, and I would just encourage everyone who doesn't want spoilers to stay away from those episodes but for these ones that are marked non-spoilers I want to try to keep it safe for them because there is some big things in this movie that I think a lot of people will freak out about um, you know the runtime one hour 37 minutes it is a very quick movie it does not slow down like once the ball gets rolling you know they have a little fun in the beginning and then it just kind of keeps going from there uh, I think it's a well better made movie than the first one uh, not to dog the first one because you guys know I do like the first one I just I don't love it but I did like the first one but it's clear that Tom, you know, listened to the criticism because I think even when we saw it with him, when he was sitting behind us, you know, afterwards he was like, tell me your thoughts, anything good or bad, tell me things about the movie. And people were giving him feedback and it seemed like he was listening to that. And then him and Kelly Marcel, who came up with the story together, and then Kelly who wrote this script, it looks like they went online and also checked out other people's feedback and tried to factor some of that in to make things either, either a little tighter, a little more clear, um, or kind of represent the comic books in a, in, a, in a more accurate way, I guess, you know, because I think the first movie, a lot of us felt a little let down by the villain, even though they had a great actor play him in Riz Ahmed. But in this one, we got Woody Harrelson, and he's amazing as Cletus Cassidy in Carnage, and also Naomi Harris, who plays Shriek, is very fantastic. So I won't go into any more details on that. I'll just say that when I walked out of there, I was very surprised by the movie, and there was definitely some surprises in it and uh, that even I wasn't expecting, and I very much enjoyed that. And I just wanted to get these quick thoughts in here in case I forget everything but worry not I do have another screening coming up over the weekend where I will get to see the movie again and uh, I will probably after that screening um, I will record my you know non-spoiler review and then when I see it a third time which I, I, I plan on seeing it a third time I will record my spoiler review that night and just save it for you know a couple weeks from now to upload so for now you get this and maybe in a couple days you'll get the non-spoiler review and then uh you know in a couple weeks you'll get the, the full spoiler discussion so uh, let me know what you know your first impressions if you see it this weekend just let me know what those are just overall like what you you know if you loved it or didn't like it or you were in the middle on it just you know give me a rating or something like that whatever but just try to keep it non-spoiler down in the comments so that everyone knows it's a safe space if they stumble across this one but yeah i was very excited and i'm even more excited they they weren't kidding when it says the universe uh, expands that they really mean that in this in a in a couple ways which a couple i'm not sure about yet i have to like process uh something i saw in the movie and i was like uh okay and then they also did one of my favorite things with the symbiote uh, that i've been waiting for now for two movies they actually uh hinted at it in this one which uh i'm excited for hopefully we'll get to see it more if it's you know if we get more of these movies which will be great so in order to get more movies we got to go see them so go out if you're able to if you feel safe go to your local cinemas and theaters and and check out this movie this weekend i think you'll have a really good time Thanks so much for watching the show. As always, like, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and I'll see you all in the future. Peace.